Hey, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to the channel, welcome to my channel. Uh, this is my second video. In the last video I made, I promised to do a Hanabi unboxing with all the Hanabi DVDs and Blu-rays I bought. So it's not going to be as big as the Mad Men unboxing just because I didn't buy that much stuff. So without further ado, here's the box. We're going to get into it. I've already opened it up to save some time. Um, but yeah, let's get into it. <laughs> Fuck no. <laughs> I guess, I guess we'll just keep going. <laughs> Alrighty, so the first one is Orishura. Um, this is one I just finished recently. When I started watching it, I thought, um, I thought it was pretty, it was enjoyable, but honestly, I thought it was a little bit average, kind of run of the mill. Um, it's a harem comedy series. It also has sort of parody elements, I guess, but as this series went on, it gets really, really funny. Um, the main character, especially with his, um, uh, what do you call it? With his like delusional, vil uh, <laughs> delusional, um, images of himself, the way he portrays himself to be like this fantasy, um, character, like, uh, what does he call himself? He calls himself, um, fuck, what does he call himself? Burning Fighting Fighter. <laughs> so, no, it's pretty funny. Um, and it definitely does yeah, warm your heart by the end of it. The characters are really lovable. Um, like, you have all your certain character archetypes, I guess. But there's a little bit of a twist thrown in with all of them. Um, I would definitely recommend this to anyone who's looking for kind of just like a light-hearted comedy. Um, uh... But yeah, I guess a harem series. There's nothing too harem-y in this, but it's um, it's a pretty good it's a pretty good watch. Let me let me let me show you these discs right now, because this one's opened. I might as well show you guys the inside of this. Um, there's disc one, and there's disc two. So it's a nice artwork on there for sure. The next one I have is called Dream Eater Mary. This is sealed. Um, I will probably get around to watching this sometime in the next coming months. I'm not 100% what it's, what it's about. Looks kind of yeah, fantasy magically. Um, but yeah, I mean, it's definitely something I would be interested in checking out. <laughs> the next one, I'm just going to go through all the DVDs first before I go through the Blu-rays. Did I get Blu-rays? Yeah, I got, I got a couple of Blu-rays in there. Oh, how am I going to say this? Hakuoki, Demon of the Fleeting Blossoms, A Memory of the Snow Flowers. Um, this is the OVA to the series. And basically, it seems to be like a feudal Japan sort of series. And those are actually some of my favorite anime. Um, anime set in like the samurai period, um, like the Edo era, era or something like that. Um, so obviously I'm going to watch the series before I watch this OVA, but, um, it looks like a pretty interesting, um, little OVA nonetheless. I think I can see like some ninjas on there, so definitely be up for checking that out. And the next DVD is Alien 9. Um, this one again is, I think it's an OVA. It looks a little bit weird and I think it's a little bit old actually, but you know, how do we license this? I don't really have any desire to check it out, I'll be honest. If you think I should check it out, maybe leave a comment. Um, but apart from that, it's probably going to stay on watch for a little while. And the final two things, I know, um, I'm already into the last two things. But as I said, this box is nowhere near as big as the other boxes. So the final two things are a couple of box sets. Um, the first one is Arakawa Under the Bridge. And... Episodes 1 to 26, you can see that one there. Um, and obviously there's part 1 and part 2 in there. Now one thing I noticed about these Hanabi box sets compared to the Mad Men box sets is they are a little bit thinner, um, probably a little bit more fragile, but as long as you, as long as I take care of it, it should be alright. This, this one I'm probably going to watch this again sometime in the coming months. Um, I 
don't really know what to expect. It kind of looks like a romance series, which I am very big fan of like romance series. So, but other than that, I don't really know what to expect. Um, this one's going to stay sealed until I watch it. So yeah. And the final, uh, the final thing in here is also a box set. This time it's a Blu-ray box set. Uh, what did I say this? F, A Tale of Memories, and F, A Tale of Melodies. So I guess that's season one and season two. Um, let me see. Stop focusing on the fucking box. What the fuck? Um, anyway, so there you go. There's the box there. Again, this is a little bit thinner in quality, like just the actual cardboard that the box is made out of. But it's a really nice box. I actually own this already on Blu-ray, just like the individual seasons, um, which I'm pretty sure are also sealed. So now I've got the box set. So one of them is going to become one of them. I'm going to open up and watch um, pretty soon, probably like I'm actually signed up to the watching challenge on myanimelist.net and that is that is one of the series that I have that I'm planning on watching. So. Um, yeah, I'll definitely open them up. In fact, let me get, let me go and grab, um, in fact, let me go and grab the two, uh, individual Blu-rays so I can show you guys without opening up that sealed one. <sighs> Man, that took me a while to find. Um, but if you're wondering, here is F, A Tale of Memories. That is season one. Um... So this one I'll probably open up and watch. And F, A Tale of Melodies, that is season two. And as you can see on the sticker right there, there's four collectible art cards inside. So that's always nice. Um, but yeah, there you go, guys. There you have it. There's my Hanabi unboxing. I know I didn't really have a lot to say about any of these series, but I haven't seen a great deal of them. So if you have anything to say about these series, which ones you think I should watch, definitely leave a comment down below. Um, and if you like the video, like the video and be sure to subscribe for more content coming soon. I'm going to be doing more than unboxings on this channel. So subscribe, stick around and I'll catch you guys in the next one. See you later guys. <laughs> that was a terrible fucking outro.